2021 marks the 30th anniversary of Big Brothers Big Sisters of Washtenaw County. Uh, one of the ways that we're celebrating this year is by shining a spotlight on our corporate partners that have worked with us throughout the years to help Big Brothers Big Sisters of Washtenaw County achieve its mission. So our spotlight for January 2021 is on Production Services Management Incorporated, otherwise known as PSMI. Um, I am very pleased to welcome Scott Burke, um, who is joining us today, the president of PSMI. Um, thanks so much for joining me today, Scott. Happy New Year. Um, hope you're doing well. Yeah, great for having me. Of course. So I just wanted to start by having you tell us a little bit about what it is that your company does here in Washtenaw County. Uh, PSMI is a global manufacturing um, services company. We provide huge manufacturing companies, Fortune, uh, Fortune 100 type companies, General Motors, John Deere, Cummins, uh, Rolls Royce, you know, Boeing, companies of this nature that we provide industrial products to help their factories run. We provide services, products, and people. Um, highly technical and uh, help our customers efficiencies to produce a lot a lot leaner a lot more efficient save money but we've grown um, tremendously over the years from an international standpoint we're managing around 250 plants uh, around the country 12 different uh, 12 different countries and um, our biggest market of course is here in, in the US uh, but we are a technology driven company um, that is uh, supporting the global manufacturing efforts uh, internationally. That's awesome. So here's the part where I get to brag a little bit about all the good things that you've done for Big Brothers Big Sisters over the years. You've um, PSMI has been our magic maker sponsor, our top sponsor of our Bull for Kids Sake event for the last three years. You've supported it much longer than that. Um, you've attended and donated at our fall evening event in September, which is always a blast. You've donated in-kind items that we've used in auctions. You've participated in adopt a family You have been on the board of directors for Big Brothers Big Sisters of Washtenaw County. So my question is, why Big Brothers Big Sisters? Um, when there are so many other deserving uh, nonprofits in our community, what is it about Big Brothers Big Sisters that draws you in? Um, I've always felt a connection with Big Brothers and Big Sisters. You know, um, having mentorship growing up, having an older brother was very important. So Big Brothers and Big Sisters has a charge of mentorship that I just think and connect with. I try to run our company that way. I try to uh, run my life that way from a mentorship, showing people, doing things for people. You know, you, you, you can't be successful until you've pulled other people up where you are. That's the, you know, one of the, the measurements of success for sure. And, and Big Brothers and Big Sisters, that's what they do. You know, they take people in the community and families and, that are requesting mentorship and they take people and help bring them up and bring them up in a way, not just financially, but, you know, of course, they bring them up with experiences and love and care. And it just connected with me. And then you meet somebody like Jennifer Spittler, who's, you know, whose mission and soul, and that's inspiring. And then you meet some of the other people there. And then you hear the stories when you see the bigs and the littles. Oh, my God. I mean, how can you not... Uh, you know, feel, feel the connection there. So for me, uh, I've always just felt that connection for the cause, for the drive of Big Brothers, Big Sisters. And I've tried to do as many things as I can for the organization. And the mission of Big Brothers and Big Sisters, I don't think anybody can deny, is one of the most important that you see the results are just as clear as, clear as can be. That's great, that's great. Um, and you kind of touched on it a little bit in your, in your last uh, response, but, January happens to be National Mentoring Month, and you are our spotlight um, for the month of January. So I want to put you on the spot and get a little personal. Um, have you, or do you have a mentoring moment in your life that sticks out, either personally, professionally, where you were the mentor or the mentee? Anything in particular that, that rings a bell? Early on in my engineering career, uh, meeting a gentleman um, in General Motors, uh, who was a who was an executive that just uh, taught me all kinds of things. You know, it was my first job into the professional or corporate world out of my undergrad. So he was a, a tremendous mentor. And the thing that I learned most about his mentorship was his kindness. That it didn't matter 
uh, at the plant, whether you were a janitor, whether it was the plant manager, you know, it didn't matter who it was. He always made time and uh, had, had a, a listening ear and would look in your eye and make sure you felt like you were being listened to. So I think that he mentored me and I think about him often when I'm reaching some challenges in communication or some of the people in my organization. I think that would be a moment that I could say was a, a person in my life who they probably don't know it, but really shaped my leadership philosophy and how I do things. That's awesome. That's awesome. We tell our mentors that often that you don't have to be wealthy. You don't have to have a big job. You just, you have to show that kindness and you have to show that is the leadership. You're right. The kindness leading with kindness is it's the secret, you know, it's the, it's the secret sauce. You know, that's, that's my big saying to everybody is uh, I just making a difference makes all the difference. And when you can try to do that and you feel like you do that on a day, any day you do that and you make a difference, you'll be happy. It's a day of happiness. So you, you can always pursue happiness by trying to make a difference and make others feel happy. And the best way to do that is with kindness, caring, and mentorship. Hence, back to the original question, why I connect or why I, I, I think Big Brothers and Big Sisters is such an important mission. That's awesome. Well, Scott, I really, really want to thank you for taking the time today to talk with us about Big Brothers, Big Sisters and about your role and about kindness and leadership. And you, you've just, you've touched on so many wonderful aspects of, of you know, what it is that we do at Big Brothers Big Sisters and why we love our corporate partners so much. You just, you are the embodiment of all of that. So uh, we hope that we can continue our relationship well into the future. We appreciate PSMI so much and um, we, we thank you. No, we, I thank you. I thank you for all you guys and what you do in the community and how hard you work and the, and the difference you make. Every day you guys make a difference. That's amazing. That's amazing. So I'm happy to support you guys and will continue to do so as long as I'm capable. Awesome.